Universal Audio Luna, tip number five, zooms. There's a couple ways to do some pretty fancy and heavy-duty zooms in Luna. First way I want to talk about is how we zoom in on a track. If we want to see this section right here, we can zoom that using the command brackets. So the right bracket will zoom in. Command left bracket will zoom back out. That's a pretty common way of doing it. But there's also a, a new way to do this in Luna. If I bring my mouse, I don't have to do any hotkeys or anything if I'm used to using a mouse. I will bring the mouse up here to the timeline into the bars and beats section. I just pull it up here. I left click like the regular mouse button, hold it down, and I drag down or up, and it zooms both ways. It also centers what we're looking at, which is a, a bonus. Let's say I want to look at this snare drum hit right here. I'll come down right onto the uh, track. I'm going to hit the tab button to tab to this transient. And I'll come up here and zoom down. And I'm right on top of it. You can actually see that it's a little bit early from the beat right there. I can do the same thing by zooming out. That's uh, pushing down and up on the mouse. There's also, if I hold down the option button, and I take two fingers on top of the mouse. If you have an Apple Magic Mouse, you can use these gestures or a trackpad. Either way, if I push Option and I put two fingers on, drag down, does the same thing. Okay, next tip. On a section of music, if I highlight this section here, I can expand that by hitting the E button on the keyboard. It zooms in the whole entire section I've highlighted. I can then edit within that. And then I can hit E again whenever I'm finished doing what I'm doing. And it zooms back out to the place that I had it before. Uh, let's try that again. I'll do this here. And we'll zoom across several tracks. And that's our expanded view. Come back down to there. Works on the single track the same way. So that is the uh, E button on the keyboard. The next tip is if I want to zoom in on the, all the tracks at one time, just make them bigger or smaller, I can use the Control and Option key plus up or down arrow, and there makes my track heights bigger or smaller. And that's for the global view. Another quick tip right there is if I hit Control, Option, and Command, and the down arrow, I get an exploded view of the entire session. That is my favorite command on the zooms. So if I'm in here, uh, if I've gone in and I've looked at this, I will hit Control, Option, Command, and down arrow, and I'm back with the selection still held, and I'll hit E again, and we have that again. To get back to normal, Control, Option, Command, down arrow. And that again gives me back to the whole entire mix. Next tip, if I need to zoom in on this waveform, if it's too small to view, even if I go this way, if I need to zoom it vertically, then I can use the hotkeys of Command, Option, and the brackets, and it will magnify them. Right bracket is magnify, and the left bracket brings it back down. You can make it even smaller. The way to get back to the original waveform is to add control to that. So now we have control option command, and if we hit the left bracket, it resets to normal. That again was control option command left bracket, and everything goes back to the original waveform. So I'm going to zoom in. I'm going to add control and back. Let's add some of these together. So if I Grab this, I'm going to hit E, and then I'm going to make the waveform larger, and then back to original. Okay, that's Universal Audio Luna tip number five, zoom features.